as an unperfect actor on the stage who with his fears put beside his part, or some fierce thing replete with too much rage whose strength's abundance weakens his own heart, so I, for fear of trust, forget to say the perfect ceremony of love's right, and in mine own love's strength seem to decay, or charged with burthen of mine own love's might. Oh, let me be then the eloquence and dumb presagers of my speaking heart, who plead for love and look for recompense more than that tongue that more hath more expressed. Oh, learn to read what silent love hath writ, to hear with eyes belongs to love's fine wit. Hey everyone, that was Sonnet 23. Um, it's Monday. Um, yeah, I uh, I actually was on a plane to Ireland last night, so that's where I am right now. Um, I'm uh, I'm here for for work for a week, um, and so I uh, I wanted to get this done as soon as I could though. So uh, yeah, so that was Sonnet 23. I'm gonna keep this video kind of short though, cause I have to run to dinner. Um, but uh, but yeah, this one was kind of it grew on me. Um, that last line is gorgeous to hear with eyes. Uh, it's, it's a nice metaphor, and I think it brings up an interesting concept of kind of um, reminiscent of the lady doth protest too much, the, the, the fact that people will use their words to compensate for maybe contradictory feelings, whether it's protesting that you don't care about someone when you actually do, or if it's that you do love someone, oh, I love them so much, but, you know, maybe you're compensating for something. So I thought that was kind of an interesting uh, uh, kind of overarching theme. Um, and, uh, yeah, it, it flo this one flows really nicely. There's some beautiful language. It um, It's kind of interesting how it starts almost in the middle of a thought. Um, it starts with as, which I'd, I'd be curious to go back and look and see how many sons start with as. Um, that's really kind of in the middle of something. So, uh, so yeah, this one was fun. Um, yeah, you can expect Sonnet 24, um, probably Saturday or Sunday of this week. Um, but yeah, sorry this is a day late, but, uh, yeah, have a great week, everyone.